Hello everyone, welcome to my channel Research and Analysis. My name is Dr. Kamran. Recently, China has launched new AI tool of DeepSeek. I, uh, when I created my new account on DeepSeek, I was thinking it's just the same as ChatGPT. But with the passage of time, I become a fan of DeepSeek. Why? This is what I am going to discuss in this video. In order to make comparison between ChatGPT and DeepSeek, we will run an experiment. In this experiment, we will write a literature review using DeepSeek and as well as using ChatGPT. Then we will make a comparison which uh, literature review have real citations. Let's first write using ChatGPT. I have written a command write a literature review on the topic of CSR and implied engagement. Use at least 15 citations and also provide complete references in bibliography. See, ChatGPT has provided us the literature review as well as the complete references in the bibliography. Now let's just confirm whether these references exist in real world or not. Now we will copy each of these references and paste in Google Scholar to check their authenticity. You can see both articles have same author details. Both are published in 2012 and the title is also just the same. And it is also better just to check from site and here you can see the complete reference. You can see both are just the same. Now copy next reference. Again paste in Google Scholar. You can see whole of the information is just same. In the same way we can check all these references. It is better just to check from the last. And then again paste in Google Scholar. Although whole of the information is just same, but there is a difference in year of publication. Here it is 2017, but in actual reference, there is 2010. This is the problem which I want you to highlight regarding ChatGPT as some of the references that provide ChatGPT are not always correct. Let's copy this reference, paste in Google Scholar and search. See, this reference do not even exist. Recently, I have observed the same problem with one of the thesis that I was examining. In that thesis, most of the references that provided by the student were incorrect and they do not even exist anywhere. It seems that the student has potentially used ChatGPT or any other AI tool for writing his literature review. If we will check other references, we will find the similar issues in those references as well. Now, we will use same prompt in DeepSeek. I just copy. This is my DeepSeek account. Let me paste same prompt here. Write a literature review on the topic of CSR and implied engagement. Use at least 15 citations and also provide complete references in bibliography. See, DeepSeek has provided us the literature review as well as the complete references in bibliography. And the good thing is they have also provided us the DOI numbers of most of the references. So it become easy for us to see their authenticity. We can simply click this DOI number and we can open this article. See, this is the article and all the information is the same as provided by DeepSeek. We can also confirm these references authenticity through Google Scholar. We can simply copy and search through Google Scholar. See, it has provided the same reference at provided by DeepSeek all of the information is just same. Now just take few other references from the last. Let's just open this DOI. You can see all the information which was given at DeepSeek is the same as given in this article. Let's just open last DOI. You can see the same title, same other details, including the DOI number. So this is the difference between ChatGPT and DeepSeek as all the references that provide by DeepSeek are correct and exist in real world. This is a, just a start and uh, hopefully with the passage of time we will learn more things what DeepSeek can do or how DeepSeek can help us in academic writing. It seems to be a game changer in academic writing. Stay tuned to our channel for more informative videos like this. Thanks for watching.